Local nonprofit Northside Neighborhood House is celebrating serving our community for a century. Leah Bowling reports on what they hope to accomplish in the next hundred years. CEO Rachel Gammon says their mission has been the same for the last 100 years, to intentionally walk alongside their neighbors, connecting them with resources to meet their needs. In the 1920s, the founders taught those in need how to quilt rather than only giving them bedding. That was a pivotal moment in our history because our founders could have just gone and gotten a blanket, but instead they decided to be in relationship with their neighbors, teach them how to quilt so they could provide for that need for themselves. Through the decades, Gammon says they have offered a hand up, not just a handout. A hand up, not a handout is really about being transformative instead of transactional. So we don't want to just meet that immediate basic need. That's part of our work. But the bigger picture is how can we empower our neighbors and connect them to resources. She added they have served the community in many different ways, adapting to the needs. Today, the neighborhood house helps with keeping families housed, with working utilities and other basic needs. We also do computer classes and cooking classes for adults. They also have 10 community schools and three thrift stores that offer low-cost clothing, as well as allowing the organization to remain sustainable. The majority of our uh, revenue, or half of our revenue, comes from our thrift stores. Um, the rest is just grants, um, investment from the United Way, individual donors supporting our Good Neighbor Fund, our annual fund, and just different special events that we do throughout the year. Gammon says she's excited to see what's in store for the next 100 years. We continue to have team members who are just committed to their neighbors and to serving and loving them well. So I feel like the next 100 years, only the best is yet to come. I'm Leah Bowling, Local 3 News.